Know your master and choose your master wisely. There is so much BS out there that you can do what you want, when you want, where you want, with who you want, and you can take your laptop and you can have no responsibilities and answer to no one and everyone does what you say. How arrogant and naive is it to think you can have all the upside of freedom and choice and profit with no responsibility and accountability? And there's these 17 year old TikTokers who haven't even got pubes telling you how to be this laptop millionaire and all these apparent influencers on LinkedIn just copying other people's posts and sharing it like they're multimillionaires when they're, they're clearly not because they haven't lived the proper life. I'm on a bit of a freaking mission to call out all this bullshit. Here's why. Because you need to know the reality of what it takes to be successful if you want to be successful. You need to know the reality, not the fantasy of what it takes to be wealthy. I saw this guy post on LinkedIn, had loads of shares of basically saying the one common thing he knows in all and wealthy people is they're unhappy. He doesn't fucking know any wealthy people because the definition of wealth is from the word wheel, which means well-being. So he, do he doesn't even understand what the word wealth means. How many millionaires does he actually know? Because by the way, I know hundreds, hundreds, and I know 21 billionaires that I've interviewed or I know personally have mentored me. None of them are unhappy. Do they have stresses? Yes. Do they have responsibilities? Yes. Do they have challenges and hardships? Yes. But so do broke people. By the way, there are downsides to everything. There's downsides to being rich and there's downsides to being broke. So choose your downside. I'd rather have the downsides of being rich than the downsides of being broke. And I know because I was 50 grand in debt 18 years ago. And I've been an entrepreneur nearly 20 years and I'm old enough to be the dads or granddads of some of these bullshitters. So here's the reality. And, and this is really important. You've just got to cut out all this waffle. The reality is you can have more time. You can have more choice. You can have more freedom. But you can't have all of that with no responsibility. It is impossible. It is not a universal law. Here's the reality. You can do more of what you want, with more of who you want, with more of when you want, but not with no accountability. So here's the reality. Everybody serves a master. And there's all these people teaching you to click a button on a laptop and be rich, saying that you don't have to have a master because you can be the master to everyone. You cannot be a master without being a servant. You cannot be a, be a boss without being someone's bitch. You can't. If you're the boss in the office, you'll be humbled by your husband or wife or children. So here's the reality of life. Everybody serves a master. You need to choose the right master. Now, if you serve a master of a massive corporate machine that's screwing the world, you pick the wrong master. If you're serving a master of a boss who's a narcissist, who's getting rich while you're going broke, you've picked the wrong master. I serve you as a master and you are a good master to me because you support me and challenge me if you think I need feedback. I, I am a servant to my staff. I am a servant to my customers. I'm a servant to my partners. I'm a servant to my investors. I'm a servant to my shareholders. I am not a master to all and a servant to none. And actually, the best way to be rich is to serve more people. So all this bullshit about you can work for yourself and be a master of everyone and a servant of no, it's completely wrong. It's the opposite. The more people you serve, the more money you'll make. Hmm. So know thy master, pick thy master wisely. If you've got narcissistic, autocratic masters that are suppressing your wealth, that's on you and you need to fire those masters and get new masters. Whereas if you choose great clients, a global community, really good investors, partners, shareholders, as masters or even partners and you serve them, you're going to be very fucking rich. Can you do more of what you want, when you want, where you want, who you want? Yes. But with more money, does it come more responsibility? And the more you serve, do you have more accountability? Yes. And so here's the difference. All these people looking to be richer with less responsibility, you need to understand that if you want to be more wealthy, you need to lean into the responsibility, take on more responsibility. And the most important thing, therefore, is accountability. With no accountability, nothing gets done. Um, I bet you the three weeks before your wedding, you dieted. <laughs> I bet you you did. I bet you when you were dumped, you went to the gym twice a day 
when you hadn't gone to the gym for a year. Why? Because you had hardcore accountability. Account, fuck, I scared the shit. People always creep up on me around here under these bridges. <laughs> shit, I nearly spat my heart out of my mouth. So, actually, if you want success, you need more responsibility and more accountability. Because when all is said and done, more is said than done. Like everyone wants to be rich. No one wants to do what it takes. Everyone wants to be rich and then hates on the rich. So I've got something that I think can really help you with this. Give me a yes in the comments if you want to increase your responsibility to increase your wealth, like in reality. Because by the way, I just pick who I'm responsible for. And I choose people who I like being responsible for. Give me a yes in the comments if you want accountability, not just to say, but to do. Because you probably learned a lot and you probably want a lot. But maybe you're not where you want to be. Why? Because ultimately, there's not enough of a reason. You haven't got enough accountability. And for accountability, you want a great mentor who's been there and done it and knows the reality. Because fantasies just create delusions. You don't need a mastermind peer network. Because you know they say, your network is your net worth. So give me a yes if you like the idea of any of this. Because I'm doing something completely unique, but you have to be quick on this because it starts at the start of next month and we're nearly at the end of this one. But... Um, Give me a yes in the comments if you'd like to enter a competition to win 10 grand, to win a place on a 25 grand mastermind program with me, uh, and to have any investment in any of your fees for mentoring or masterminded paid back to you and completely for free. Give me a yes in the comments if you'd like that. Now, by the way, this isn't something that's um, you know, a simple, nice, easy freebie. Here's the problem. Most people think they can get rich watching YouTube videos. If that was the case, everyone would be rich. Free advice is worth every penny. When you pay, you pay attention. So here's what I'm doing. I'm launching something brand new called the Race to 10K. It's a, a combination of a challenge, but one that works, not just a freebie one. And mentoring with me, but not on my 48 grand plus VAT fees, not even at my 25 grand mastermind fees, not even at my lower level 12 grand group mastermind program, not even half of that. So it's like four or five way discount. And there's reasons for me doing this, by the way. But also being around positive, like-minded, inspired, energetic, enthused people who you want to collaborate with, but you also want to compete and kick their ass and win cash. So if you like the idea of any of this, I recommend you apply for my brand new, completely novel and disruptive in this industry. It's going to piss off my competitors for, four, uh, for sure. It's called the Race to 10K Challenge. So let me... R-A-C-E T O one zero K dot com, which is race to 10 K, but 10 spelt one zero. So the link for the app, by the way, when you um, go onto that page, doesn't automatically charge your credit card. You can't pop buy for it now. You have to apply. I review your application. My team review your application. You have a, a consultation to check that it's right for you. I'm not taking anyone's money if it's not right for them. I'm also not accepting everyone in. Um, if you're like a, a freebie seeker or you join mastermind after mastermind after mastermind and do nothing with it and blame the, uh, you know, the mentor, I'm not looking to work with you. By the way, if you don't have any money, that's fine. You just need to find the money to get started. And then I'll teach you to find more and more finance as we go through the program. If you're interested, in it, if you're committed, yes. But you don't need to be committed to me. You need to be committed to your future committed to your accountability, committed to your wealth. So it's called race210k.com. So there's the link. Go and apply. Um, if you're successful through stage one, my team will call you to stage two. And here's the thing. It is about 85 or percent or more of my usual one-to-one -one mentoring fees. Um, and it's about 70-odd percent of my masterminding fees. Here's the reason why. Number one is you are now halfway through the year and you're probably nowhere near your goals. Most people launch these things in January. I'm disrupting and I'm launching it, launching it halfway through the year to accelerate you to hit the, the end of year, the goals and desires, but in six months, not a year. So I think that would be twice as valuable. Number two is I love mentoring on WhatsApp. I love answering questions regularly on WhatsApp. All my competitors and anyone who does anything like this hates it. You never get their mobile number. They want a, they want a, a, a 30 minute one to one phone call every three months. They don't want to help you. They just want you to pay. Whereas I spend two hours a day replying to my clients and mentees in on WhatsApp because actually my diary is much better like that. I do 20,000 steps a day. I don't want to spend hours doing coaching calls. And also, if you've got a question, you want it answered now, not in eight weeks.
So, the link is raceto10k.com. And this is a unique opportunity for you to get access to me as your mentor. I've been in business 20 years. I've done 250 million in sales. I own 340 plus rental units in my property portfolio. I've written 19 of the top business and entrepreneur and real estate books in the UK. I've got 14 companies. I was a millionaire, age 31, and a deca millionaire, age 35, which was 10 years ago. I can help you. And I'm also looking for 50 amazing case studies to um, fill uh, at my um, new brand that I'm launching at the start of next year. So I'm prepared to give you a big discount in exchange for that. So you joining basically commits to being successful and then sharing the story with me. Um, so I need you to commit to doing that. Also, nearly half your fee, even after all the discounts, is only payable when you hit 10 grand a month. If you don't hit 10 grand a month, you never pay nearly half the fee. So I don't actually know anyone else that does this. Most people aren't prepared to do this because their shit doesn't work. And my shit works. One of my clients said to me a couple of weeks ago, Rob, you were inspiring when you broke the world record. I sat in the audience and I wanted to be like you. I've just done my first million pound month, a million pound month. And this challenge of masterminding and mentoring is all about hitting 10 grand a month as quickly as possible. I'm gamifying it by giving away cash and prizes and competitions. We've got loads of special bonuses, master documents, templates, how to launch your products and services, how to create compelling offers. It's all in the race to 10K. And all you have to do is apply and let's see if you get through to the next stage. So go to R-A-C-E-T-O-1-0-K.com right now and get rid of this naive delusion spouted by wanky fake influencers that you don't have to be accountable to anyone. You do what you want, when you want, where you want, with who you want. It's a naive fantasy. Now, you can choose your master, so choose them wisely. I would love to work for a billionaire. I mean, I love to work for myself, but if I had to work for anyone, I'd love to work for a billionaire. I'd love to be an apprentice to a, a, a billionaire. Even though I own my own businesses, why not? Because I could learn so much. Because remember, the more you learn, the more you earn. Now, many people spend on a TV what they can invest in this program. A big TV, but still a TV. So would you rather have a TV that dumbs you, your brain and melts your intellect and hypnotizes and propagandizes you and goes down by three quarters in value? Or would you rather invest in your knowledge, experience, education, mentoring in a mastermind and maybe get a 10x or a 100x return on what you learn? Because I went from 50 grand in debt to 250 million in sales in 18 years just changing one single thing, which was turning a liability into an asset, a, a, a mental liability into a mental asset, a physical liability into a physical asset. And this is what the race to 10K will do for you. You can ask me 20 questions a day if you want, six months straight. Where else can you get that? I'm pretty sure my competitors are going to be upset with me, but they can kiss my ass. So go apply now at race210k.com and choose your master wisely because we all have them and look to serve many people. And if you don't risk anything, you risk everything.